What's up muscle car people? This is Brain Muscle Cars and I'm Matt. Today we're gonna wrap the hood on one of Jared's boxes. So this hood is not the original hood that came on the car. It's actually a junkyard hood. It does have some damage in the middle and it did add some hood pins. So we're gonna show you how to wrap the hood, but I'm also gonna show you what the wrap will and will not cover and what it will look like if you try to cover a spot on the hood or a spot on the side of the car or whatnot. Let's take a look at the spot. Hopefully you can hear me. Can you, can you say that I have pins in because the factory hood latch and support is all wrecked? Can you at least give me can, some credit? Can you, you say that. Just So Matt's going to throw me under the bus here. He likes hood pins. It has hood pins because... Don't touch it. I just cleaned the car. <laughs> Got it real dirty. You did too, didn't you? It's like I put grease prints on Come it. Come on, man. Like, seriously. I didn't think of that. I didn't think of that. Matt's Don't bad. touch it. I get it. I'm gonna Don't touch it. Just, hey. Come over here. Matt's, Matt's throwing a fit. It, it's a wrecked car, and the factory hood latch mechanism and mounting points are all broken. And since we don't do things the right way here, well, I don't. I put hood pins in, so it stays secure. Here is the spot on the hood. It's not flat. It's almost flat, but not quite. You can kind of see it's dimples, and you can see that the metal is exposed. We are going to wrap it in matte black, and we'll see how it turns out. And there's a couple spots. I did sand them a little bit. Road rash spots on the front of the car. I sanded them, but we'll see how those turn out too. So, all right. Now all we have to do is get to it. All right guys, the wrap we're gonna use is Avery Dennison, matte black. What happened to the gloss? I don't have enough gloss. Use gloss. I didn't approve this. What? You don't want the- But then again, I'm not paying for it right. and beggars can't be choosers, right. so. Good job, Matt. You want this Good job, proud of you. Not. So this is leftover from doing my Mustang. We did clean the hood again after he touched it, so don't worry about that. Make sure if you are wrapping a hood or fenders or anything like that, you do get underneath it really well because that's where it's going to fail if you don't. So, all right, I'm going to wash my hands and then I'm going to make Jared help me gloss this out and we're going to put it down. Let's get to it. And then you're going to have to hold like here and we're going to pull tight. Okay. Avery says like now, what happened? Yeah, it's fine. It's not going to fall on the hood. It's fine. It's not going to fall. Okay, I'm asking, man. I'm just asking. It's fine. Don't yell at me for being a noob here. Like, the most wrapping I've done has been like a fucking. <laughs> you have more stickers on than any two people I know. I'm not good at it. See, it doesn't stick. That's the property. You got to pull it. Pull it tight. Pull it. Yeah, you're not pulling it. Keep pulling it. And you're done. It's called glassing. I would be done with that's the problem.
Jared messed up. Not one, not two, but three batteries. So we had to miss out on some of this and we filled up two memory cards because we never delete them. So you missed a little bit of it, but not the most important part. So we got it all done. It took, uh, what, maybe an hour and a half, Jared? Uh, it took less time to pull the AC compressor out of my G8. So, hour and a half, two hours. Hour and a half, we'll go with. It turned out pretty good. The mat is easy to work with. You have to make sure that if you're doing matte black or any matte color, you don't heat it or stretch it too much because that will show up on, it will change the color. So it will show up on the hood or the panel that you're doing. All right, so let's take a closer look at this part right here. So you can see how it looks up close. You can tell that it's messed up, but it is all one single color. Jared, can you like back away and show what it looks like? Can you tell that it's messed up? Yeah, if you get the light in the right spot, you can see the, right, the, the dimple, dimple on it. Yeah. Uh, right in, in some spots, there. it makes it look worse than it would have just leaving it alone. But at least the hood is all one color now. So, turned out pretty good. Make sure you post heat. So we went all the way around, post heated it look pretty good so we'll see the car was hit so it's not perfect not the hood is not but it's not lined up the body panels are not perfect but we'll see how well they hold up thanks for watching if you like that this video hit that like button hit that subscribe button there's gonna be more wrapping stuff there's gonna be more racing hopefully someday we can race there's not recording there's gonna be racing stuff at some point it's sometime there will be uh, more tool stuff so if you're into fast cars cool cars box cars you know this is the channel to be watching so hit that like button hit that subscribe button smash that notification bell so you don't miss any awesome updates also if you got a fast car like us you better bring it thanks for watching guys all right guys Thanks for watching this video. I'm gonna link a couple more videos that if you like this one and you made it all the way to the end, you're gonna definitely like these. So watch them. Also, that middle button right there, I think is probably, you know, somewhere in there. Hit that button to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more action.